Hi everyone, it's me Brock from Trade and thank you for joining my live trading session where you are about to see me trade live and watch my PL live, which is probably the best way to learn trading. Mark is going to start today down 0.4% the SP, 0.3% the NASDAQ. However, the overall trend during the last several days, two weeks, is up and strong. So it's probably just a small pullback of a big upside move that we've seen on Friday. Anyway, let me welcome my trading room members, start the trading session right now. Please don't forget to hit that like button and plenty of links below if you want to join me in my live trading room where I call my picks live each and every day. Now let's the trading start. Hi traders, good to see you all here. Welcome our traders in our live trading room and of course those of you who are joining from YouTube. Market is open and we are starting with a gap down today. S&P is down 0. Point, almost 0.3%, Nasdaq down 0.4%, Tesla is strong up 0.9%, Riot is down 3%, Coin is down around 1% and we've got Boeing very strong up 3%. We could go for a Boeing gap and go over 80. BA. I'm posting it. Watching Boink for long. Stop loss is likely to be around one dollar. I'm long Boink. Posting MU under 73.90. Stop's going to be around 30 to 40 cents. MU is down today 1.8%. It's very weak. Come on, Boeing, let's go to a new high. Yeah, come on. Yeah, that's the way to do it. Get ready for a partial in Boeing. Perfect. Took now my partial in Boeing at around one point. My first uh, trade traders, and as you can see, I'm up 1700 and still riding 200 shares in Boeing. Market's initial direction is down. We started down around 0.3%. Now we're down 0.4. Nasdaq is down 0.5. Not much of a move though. Still interested in MU as I posted under 73.90. It's getting close. I'm reducing my size in MU, although the stop is relatively small. Kind of a little bit suspicious about what it's doing because it's really just going sideways. I was hoping to see some kind of a downtrend. I don't see that. Its only advantage is the fact that it's down 1.7%. It is an advantage, of course, but kind of feel something may be wrong. So smaller size, 30 cents or 30 cents stop loss. That's my plan for now in MU. Market continues to come down, not by much. MU is close. I'm short MU. I'm selling some more Boeing here. It's a two point profit. It's a bit extended to the upside now. MU just broke under the lows. It looks good. I'm just looking for 30 cents, which means another 10 cents or so. Baba looks nice for a short. MU is approaching my target price. Needs to come slightly under 60. Right here, this could be it. 
Okay, I'm taking a partial here, just above 60. Took my partial in It's a very small winner. Honestly, I did not trust it that much. Okay, traders, just 15 minutes into the trading session. And as you can see, I've got two winners, actually very small winners. Uh, MU very small because I found it a little bit hard to trust it. It was kind of going sideways and the market was coming down, but wasn't coming down that strong. So I took uh, a very small trade for me, 2000 shares, because it's small because the stop loss was 30 cents. So I was risking 500 or so, maybe $600. And I took a very small winner, 400 and something dollars, still riding 200 shares. So I'm hoping it's going to continue coming down. It's a kind of a gap and go because it crashed down, tried to move higher, failed, and then came down. Same idea with Boeing. Take a look at Boeing. Boeing is up 4.3%. So with Boeing, it was rather easier because it's a well-known company, a lot of volume. Watch the volume here, over 3 million shares. There's a lot of volume also in MU, over 1.3 million shares. But normally, more people will follow Boeing. So when a Boeing, when a, a company like Boeing has a gap and go potential, you wait for it to try and move lower. There's always some kind of profit taking. And then you look for the reversal and then you go long at some point. So more people will follow a big breakout over the highs and a continuation and a nice two trades to start my morning with. So just over $2,000 in 15 minutes. Thank you very much for watching. Please hit that like button if you like this video and plenty of links below. Join me. All of these pics were called live in my live trading home. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in my next videos.